The urinary system is also known as the renal system, and it consists of the kidneys, the ureters, the bladder, and the urethra. Your kidneys are bean-shaped organs that are about the same size as a computer mouse. To find your kidneys, put your hands on your lower back and slide them up until you feel your ribs. Your kidneys are just behind a layer of muscle there. All your blood flows through your kidneys 400 times a day in order to filter out the waste. However, they also have other roles, as explained in the video, what is homeostasis? Keeping your body balanced is very important and the urinary system plays an important role in this. It keeps the water levels, ions such as potassium, sodium, calcium, magnesium and phosphate, pH, and blood pressure as close to constant as possible. The blood goes into the kidneys via the renal arteries. It is then filtered into a million small filtering units called nephrons. Waste is then removed and flows down the ureters to the urinary bladder. The clean blood then leaves the kidneys via the renal veins and can return to the body. The liquid that collects in the bladder is called the urine. It contains ure, which is a waste product from the breakdown of the excess protein. It also contains excess water that the body doesn't need along with some ions like sodium and potassium. Did you know your bladder can hold up to 800 milliliters of urine? There are two little sphincters that control when to release the urine from the bladder. The first one opens up automatically when the bladder starts to get full. Luckily, we have voluntary control over the second one, so we can hold on that extra bit longer if we need. Sometimes, your kidneys can fail. A long-term complication associated with diabetes and blood pressure is kidney failure. This is obviously not good as waste builds up in the blood very quickly. If this happens, you will need to go to hospital regularly and go on a dialysis machine. Dialysis does the same job as your kidneys, filtering the waste out of the blood and balancing water and ions. Hopefully, at some stage, you would be able to have a kidney transplant. The best thing about kidneys is that you actually only need one to function. So a healthy person can donate one of theirs to you, and you can both function normally. Magic. To learn more about how kidneys remove urea from the body, watch the following video.